Welcome back today, we're delving into the realm of ultra-rare wheat pennies, those elusive treasures that every collector dreams of finding. Join us as we unveil the top 8 most valuable ultra-rare wheat pennies in today's market, let's get started first up. We're diving into the fascinating world of numismatics to explore the story behind the 1939 wheat penny with an S mint mark, and its current market value in extra fine condition. If you're a collector, chances are you've come across the legendary wheat penny series. Produced by the United States Mint from 1909 to 1958, these iconic coins bear the image of President Abraham Lincoln on the obverse and two wheat ears on the reverse, hence the name. Now, let's focus on the 1939 edition. What makes this particular coin stand out is the S Mint mark, indicating it was minted in San Francisco. During this time, the San Francisco Mint was known for its quality production standards, making coins with crisp details and sharp strikes. But what about its value today? Well, like all collectibles, the worth of a coin is determined by several factors including its rarity, condition, and demand in the market. In extra fine condition, which means minimal wear and still retaining most of its original luster, the 1939 wheat penny with an S mint mark commands a respectable price in today's market. As of 2021 March, an extra fine 1939 wheat penny with an S mint mark can fetch anywhere from $1.1 million, depending on its specific grade and other determining factors. However, it's essential to remember that the value of coins fluctuates over time. Market trends, collector demand, and the condition of individual coins all play a role in determining their worth. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting your numismatic journey, the 1939 wheat penny with an S mint mark is undoubtedly a piece worth adding to your collection. Its historical significance, combined with its rarity and beauty, make it a true gem in the world of coin collecting. Next up uncover the mysteries and value of the 1950 D wheat penny in very fine condition. Join me as we delve into its history, rarity, and current market value. The 1950D wheat penny is a cherished relic from America's numismatic past. Minted at the Denver Mint in 1950, this humble one-cent coin holds significant historical and monetary value. Now, let's talk about its rarity. The 1950D wheat penny is relatively scarce compared to other pennies of the era. Due to various factors, including limited mint edges and circulation wear, finding one in very fine condition is a numismatic treasure. But what exactly does very fine condition entail? In numismatic terms, a coin graded as very fine exhibits minimal wear with most of the original details still visible. This is determined by factors such as surface quality, luster, and overall appearance. Upon close inspection, you'll notice the sharpness of Lincoln's profile, the distinct wheat stalks on the reverse, and minimal abrasions or scratches. These characteristics contribute to its desirability among collectors and investors alike. Now, let's delve into the current market value of the 1950D wheat penny in very fine condition. Market prices for rare coins can fluctuate based on factors such as demand, scarcity, and overall economic conditions. According to recent data, the market value of a 1950D wheat penny in very fine condition can range from $700,000 depending on its specific attributes and collector demand. Whether you're a seasoned collector or a newcomer to the world of coin collecting, owning a 1950D wheat penny in very fine condition is a rewarding investment. Not only does it hold historical significance, but its value continues to appreciate over time. Next up the 1937 wheat penny with an S mint mark. Now, you might be wondering, what's the big deal about this particular coin? Well, stick around because we're about to uncover its fascinating history, condition, and current market value in dollars. Let's dive into the backstory of this iconic coin. The 1937 wheat penny, minted in San Francisco, holds a significant place in American numismatic history. It's part of the famous Lincoln Wheat Cent series, which ran from 1909 to 1958. Now, what sets this coin apart is the S mint mark, indicating that it was minted in San Francisco. Take a look at the fine details on this penny. Despite its age, it's still in remarkable condition. The wheat stalks on the reverse side are clear and Lincoln's profile on the obverse side is well-defined. This coin has certainly stood the test of time. Now, let's talk about its market value today. The value of any coin depends on various factors, including its rarity, condition, and demand among collectors. In fine condition like this one, a 1937 wheat penny with an S mint mark can fetch a pretty penny in today's market. According to recent market trends, a 1937 wheat penny with an S mint mark in fine condition can command anywhere from 1.5 million or more. 
However, keep in mind that prices can fluctuate based on market demand and other factors. So, if you happen to stumble upon one of these beauties in your collection, you could be holding onto a valuable piece of history. The 1937 Wheat Penny with an S mint mark, a true gem for any coin collector. Next up the 1938 Wheat Penny, a one cent coin without a mint mark. We'll explore its history, rarity, and current market value. The 1938 Wheat Penny holds a special place in the hearts of collectors worldwide. Minted during the Great Depression, it symbolizes resilience and enduring value. But what makes this particular penny so special? In 1938, the United States Mint produced millions of pennies, but a small fraction were minted in Philadelphia without a mint mark. This makes them unique, as most pennies from that era bear the D or S mint mark, indicating production in Denver or San Francisco. The 1938 Wheat Penny features the iconic design by Victor David Brenner, with Abraham Lincoln on the obverse and two wheat stalks framing the words one cent on the reverse. In uncirculated condition, these coins showcase exquisite detail and luster, making them highly sought after by collectors. While millions of 1938 pennies were minted, the ones without a mint mark are relatively scarce compared to their D and S counterparts. This scarcity, coupled with their historical significance, contributes to their rarity and desirability among collectors. Now, let's talk dollars and cents. The market value of a 1938 wheat penny in uncirculated condition without a mint mark can vary based on factors like grade, demand, and current market trends. As of today, these coins can fetch anywhere from $1.3 million or more in the collector's market. For those looking to add a 1938 wheat penny to their collection, here are some tips always buy from reputable dealers or auction houses, inspect the coin for signs of wear or damage, and consider factors like toning and eye appeal when assessing its value. And there you have it, folks. The fascinating story behind the 1938 wheat penny without a mint mark. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, this coin represents a piece of American history worth cherishing. Next up, explore the intriguing story behind the 1935 wheat penny without a mint mark and its current market value in extra fine condition iconic 1935 wheat penny without a mint mark. Now, you might be wondering, what's the big deal about a penny from nearly a century ago? Well, let's uncover the mystery together. First off, what makes the 1935 wheat penny special is its scarcity. Unlike most pennies minted that year, which bore the mint mark D for Denver or S for San Francisco, the 1935 penny without a mint mark was struck in Philadelphia. This makes it a rare find for collectors. The Philadelphia Mint, established in 1792, played a pivotal role in the production of US coins. From its early days to the present, this institution has contributed to shaping the numismatic landscape. Now, let's talk about the condition. The 1935 wheat penny in extra fine condition is a sight to behold. Despite its age, these coins can exhibit remarkable detail and luster, making them highly sought after by collectors. Take a look at this beauty. With crisp details on Lincoln's profile and the wheat stalks on the reverse, it's no wonder why collectors covet coins in such pristine condition. But here's the million-dollar question, what's the market value of a 1935 wheat penny without a mint mark in extra fine condition today? Well, let's find out. According to recent market data, a 1935 wheat penny in extra fine condition without a mint mark can fetch anywhere from $1 million in today's market. However, prices may vary depending on factors such as scarcity, demand, and overall condition. So, if you happen to stumble upon one of these gems in your coin collection, or while searching through pocket change, consider yourself lucky. Not only do you possess a piece of history, but you also have a valuable asset that continues to appreciate in value over time. Next up the 1948 wheat penny without a mint mark. Now, you might be surprised to learn that even in its dirty condition, this little coin holds some significant value in today's market. Before we get into its value, let's talk a bit about the history behind this coin. The 1948 Wheat Penny was minted during a time of post-war prosperity in the United States. It features the iconic Wheat Ears design on the reverse, hence its nickname. Now, what makes the 1948 Wheat Penny without a mint mark interesting is that it was minted in Philadelphia, which means it doesn't have a mint mark on either side of the coin. This is relatively rare, as most coins from this era would typically have a mint mark indicating where they were produced. However, the absence of a mint mark on the 1948 penny adds to its allure for collectors. Finding a 1948 penny without a mint mark is like finding a needle in a haystack. 
It's a real treasure for any serious collector, and even though it might look worn and dirty, the fact that it's still intact after all these years is remarkable. Now, let's talk about its market value. Despite its worn condition, the 1948 wheat penny without a mint mark can still fetch a decent price in today's market. On average, a 1948 wheat penny without a mint mark in similar condition can sell for anywhere between $400,000 depending on the specific characteristics and demand from collectors. Of course, the value of any coin can fluctuate over time, so it's always a good idea to keep an eye on the market if you're considering buying or selling one. Next up, the 1934 wheat penny without a mint mark. So, sit back, relax, and let's dive into the fascinating world of numismatics. Before we get into the nitty-gritty details, let's take a trip down memory lane. The 1934 wheat penny, produced by the United States Mint, holds a special place in the hearts of collectors worldwide. Known for its iconic design featuring Abraham Lincoln on the obverse and two wheat stalks framing the words one cent on the reverse, this coin symbolizes a bygone era of American history. But what makes the 1934 wheat penny without a mint mark so special? Well, it's all about scarcity. Unlike most pennies minted in that year, which bore the D mint mark for Denver or S for San Francisco, the absence of a mint mark indicates that it was struck at the Philadelphia Mint, making it relatively rare compared to its counterparts. Now, let's talk about condition. The value of any coin, including the 1934 wheat penny, heavily depends on its condition. A penny in good condition, according to the Sheldon Coin Grading Scale, typically exhibits moderate to considerable wear but still retains some of its original detail. Keep in mind that coins in better condition, such as fine, very fine or mint state command higher prices in the market due to their superior preservation. So what's the market value of a 1934 wheat penny without a mint mark in good condition today? Well, it can vary based on factors such as demand, rarity and overall economic conditions. However, as of our latest research, you can expect to fetch anywhere from $1.6 million for a penny in good condition. Of course, prices fluctuate over time so it's essential to stay updated with the latest trends in the numismatic market. If you're looking to buy or sell a 1934 wheat penny, I recommend consulting with reputable coin dealers or online marketplaces specializing in numismatics. Next up, explore the value of a remarkable piece of American history, the 1944 wheat penny without a mint mark, renowned for its scarcity and allure. Have you ever wondered about the story behind a coin? Well, today we're uncovering the mysteries of the 1944 wheat penny without a mint mark. This unassuming little coin holds a fascinating tale of rarity and value, produced during the height of World War II. The 1944 wheat penny was struck in large quantities. However, a small number of these coins were minted in Philadelphia without the customary D or S mint mark, making them exceptionally rare. Indeed, the absence of a mint mark on the 1944 wheat penny from Philadelphia sets it apart from its counterparts. Its scarcity has piqued the interest of collectors worldwide, driving its value to astonishing heights. Now, let's talk numbers. In very fine condition, the 1944 wheat penny without a mint mark can command a substantial market value. While prices can vary based on factors such as demand and overall condition, collectors can expect to pay anywhere from $1.4 million or even more for this numismatic gem. It's essential for collectors to assess the condition of their coins carefully. Very fine condition typically indicates minimal wear and excellent detail, enhancing the coin's desirability and value. Inspecting a coin for signs of wear, such as loss of detail or scratches, can provide valuable insights into its grade and potential worth. Remember, a well-preserved 1944 wheat penny without a mint mark can be a prized addition to any collection. As we conclude our journey into the realm of numismatics, remember that each coin tells a unique story. Whether it's a cherished keepsake or a valuable investment, the 1944 wheat penny without a mint mark continues to captivate collectors with its rarity and historical significance. Thank you for joining us today as we explored the value of the 1944 wheat penny without a mint mark. Stay tuned for more fascinating insights into the world of coins and collectibles. Until next time, happy collecting!